watch. I'm not sure if they've busted a million myths, but those myth busters, they're taking their show out on the road tomorrow. A brand new exhibit featuring the very popular TV show opens up at the Tech Museum in San Jose. And I couldn't think of a better guy to send over there to check this one out. NBC Barry is Bob Riddell. He is live there right now. Bob, I got to imagine you're probably busting some myths as we speak. And it is the foundation on which all the experimentation you do on Mythbusters is built. I am. One myth is that I actually know what I'm talking about, and you're going to find soon enough that is clearly not the case. Good morning to you, John. Not only can you come here and see props from the actual Mythbusters show, this is the show that was created by Adam Savage and Jamie Heineman, both uh, local guys. You can actually come here and bust your own myths yourself. For example, you see the telephone booth over there. You can figure out, is it true that those superheroes can really go into a telephone booth and change into their crime-fighting costumes and lightning speed? Or you come over here and, and figure out whether those two pigs who built their houses out of straw and sticks were bad, bad architects, or was there something else going on? Or you can come to this rain tunnel. That's why we got Roque Montez. And what are you trying to bust here? Uh, good, morning, good morning, good morning. Well, you know, we've all been there before, right? You're caught in the middle of a, a rainstorm without right? an umbrella, and you've got this urge to run. Well, this exhibit raises the question, will you really stay drier walking or running? You got the slow lane, I got the run? I'm game. All right, let's do it. I'm running. I'm definitely getting wet. He's taking a nice stride. <laughs> And the good thing is, they've put some killer radioactive dye in the water so that when you come to the black light, it really shows up pretty well to see who got more <laughs> rain on them. Wow, I got it on my head pretty good. Um, as did I. But you didn't get it as bad. So I guess the misconception is walk. That's correct. All right, here's one. This is something I always like to do in a restaurant so I can get arrested. You can or cannot pull the... Uh, I think you can. You can? Go ahead. Absolutely. So what, what's the trick to it? The trick is to pull down and out, out. very quickly. Very quickly. All righty. Okay. On three. One, two, three. Nice. Wow. The magician. Oh, one myth that I always, that's driven me up the wall. I play. Kids got skills. Magic fingers. Well done. Hey, quickly. This opens tomorrow here at the Parkside Hall next to the Tech Museum. Runs through January. Quickly. Playing cards. You can really? You can. Stick it into a target? Absolutely. What do you think the speed's going to be? There's the uh, radar gun. Like I think of the right. Flick of the wrist. That's right. Flick of the wrist? Oh, that was ah. monumentally awful. You got nine miles an hour. Wow, you're going for six. Get him, get All right, you guys. I think you've got new some bus trick cards here. here. 25 miles an hour. Wow. It can be done. Those aren't staged. They actually can be stuck into that. I'm not so dangerous board. after all. You're not. <laughs> <laughs> all right, you guys. That is, that is pathetic. <laughs> hey, have a good weekend. Thank you, Bob. Bob, hey, Bob yeah. Kane. Yeah, someone better call Bob's wife to let him know he's going to be late. I have a feeling he's going to be hanging out there all day <laughs> he's today. He's a big kid. <laughs> I love it. That's beautiful. Okay, Christina, how's the forecast looking on